I could probably spend all day just on this floor alone. That's right, Snoopy. Life is too short to not live it up a little. Kinda looks like me when I am hungry. Hey, explorers. Did you know there's an entire museum devoted to Snoopy in Tokyo? Today, we're visiting the Snoopy Museum Tokyo in Minami Machida, where you can get your fill of all things Snoopy and the Peanuts gang. We'll check out the exhibits, look at all the merchandise, and of course, try some of the food. With that said, let's head inside. There are lights up here with a whole bunch of Snoopy flushes. <laughs> We have some more artwork and stuff here. And then over here, I love the washroom signs. That is really fun. I love little details like that. I think it's so fun. When you pick up your ticket, you're gonna get a paper ticket like this, but on the back, there are different comics. And what's special about these comics is they released on February 1st. You want to know why that's significant? It's because the Snoopy Museum reopened on February 1st. So these comics were released on that date with various years. So there's one here from 1957, February 1st, 1977, 1967, and 1997. So you're gonna get one of these randomly. And I think that is such a cute little detail. That's enough talking. I want to head inside and show you around. Oh, I like the little mirrors up here. <laughs> we're gonna head up to the third floor. That's where we're gonna start. Okay, the first place we're going is Snoopy Wonder Room. Okay. Oh my goodness. Look at this, there's so many Snoopies. Oh, this is adorable. Man, if you are a Snoopy fan, you're gonna love this. I recognize some of those. I recognize some of these. If you see one that you recognize, like maybe you have it or something, let me know. I want to know. Oh, look at him. Uh, such a good boy. <laughs> oh, there's like McDonald's toys and stuff too. See the McDonald's toys there. Oh, these look like, oh, they're from Pepsi, like the Pepsi bottle caps. Some manga there. Oh, wow. We're off to a great start. <laughs> I like the Halloween ones. I really like the Halloween ones. Those are cute. I recognize those cups. I think we had those. Or at least one of them, anyway. That is so vintage. Oh my goodness, that is, this is fantastic. You can just tell some of these are very loved. like Snoopy. That's fun. Let's head to the next room. We're in the next room here and this is going through the history of everything. I'm not going to read all that but if you want you can pause to read. All right. So this is not renewed. The other room was renewed with the, all the merchandise. 
So if you're really into the history of peanuts, you're gonna love this. Ugh, I love like history stuff like this. I just, I love just reading through it all. And you can see there's English on here too, which is really nice. There's a lot to read here. So, Peanuts. So, Peanuts, Early Strips, America, Nap, Unique, Translator, Santa Rosa. I like the Snoopy in the back. <laughs> you can take your time and just soak it all in. There's a lot here. And then there is Introductions to all the characters. If you need a little bit of a refresher, you know, our boy Snoopy and Charlie Brown. And again, we got stuff in English here. Oh, Linus. And Lucy. I love how colorful it is. I love that they have like the colored comic strips and stuff here. I could probably spend all day just on this floor alone, just going through and reading everything. I grew up watching Peanuts, like watching the cartoon. Um, I didn't read the comic strips all that often. I, I did read it, like if I saw it in, in the newspaper or whatever, I would read it. But I was mostly focused on the cartoon and I always remember <laughs> the tree, the tree that ate the kite, that like that just like stuck in my mind. Woodstock. <laughs> Man, there's a lot here. Hey, Franklin. Oh, I love Peppermint Patty. Marcy. <laughs> oh, and Pigpen, yep. Oh, and then there's a terrace. outside on the terrace here and some golf <laughs> oh look at that oh that is fun yeah there's Snoopy playing golf oh. that is so cute oh, I love that Oh, okay, they're, they're all watching him. Okay, I think. I think that's what's happening. Oh, you can see Mount Fuji. Way in the distance, so there's some hills there and then just over is Mount Fuji. Oh, that's really pretty. It's a really nice clear day out today. What's better than Snoopy and Mount Fuji? Okay, let's head back inside. Okay, we're going down to the second floor. We are on the, the top floor. These cute little comics. It's just so charming. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hi, right, Charlie Brown. Statue of Charlie Brown in front of Charles M. Schultz Museum and Research Center. Ooh. Oh, what's in this next room? Oh, look at the big Snoopy. Oh, I want to pet you. It says not to touch, but I want to pet you. You're such a good boy. Oh, the, this is huge. <laughs> oh, this is fun. <laughs> Good boy. You're a good boy. <gasps> oh. Oh, my 
heart, my heart. Okay, well, I'm not gonna, is he planking? 2012 called. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> That's fun. Oh. Hi, Snoopy. I love this one. Kind of looks like me when I am hungry. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. I love, this is probably my favorite part so far. This is so good. I like this. I really love this. Such a good boy. Good boy, Snoopy. Before we go into the other room, there's like a little light show that's happening. <laughs> well, that's fun. Oh. This is really cute. I don't know where to look. I'm just kind of pointing wherever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's head into the other room now. The next room is Traveling Peanuts, and they have some of the original comic strips, like this right here. That is so cool. I'm like geeking out right now. I love that. That is so neat. As I mentioned, there's just a lot of information, lots of reading. It's just like any museum. This is so well laid out. Kansas City. <laughs> Here's another original one from May 10th, 1994. The other one before was from 1984. Let's go to summer camp. Oh, I like the little stamp right there. Snoopy Museum Tokyo 2024. So this, this one is new. Like this is a, a new exhibit. Is this more? Yeah, more originals. Okay, so the ones that are in these cases here are original comic strips. This is from June 18th, 1994. I like these stamps. It's a nice, nice little detail. Another comic strip. No, November 25th, 1975. I wasn't even born then. Oh, there's another room. Hmm, what's over here? <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Rats, no one wants to be my skating partner. Well, that's all right. I'll just go on home. I have a very happy home. You sure do, Snoopy. It's... I didn't realize it was so big in real life. <laughs> this is really cute. Oh my goodness. I really wish I could climb up there and like sleep on it. Cause that would be iconic if you could do that. That would have been amazing. But that's okay, this is still pretty cool. <laughs> and they have all the different characters. So Snoopy and Woodstock. That's me right there. <laughs> There's people putting notes here. Yeah, that's me, looking at food and chaos, yeah. Maybe not that, I can't do that. I can't stand on my head, I'm not even gonna try. Oh. 
I love this. I love this so much. We're heading down to the first floor here because we're going to go check out the shop. And yes, there's more comics here in the stairwell. 1958, huh? <laughs> oh, okay. I understand the statue from earlier. He's wearing, he's wearing a mask, a Halloween mask. Okay, that makes sense. I, I don't know why I didn't recognize that. Okay, that's that's funny. <laughs> So we got the store. <laughs> There's a lot of merchandise in here. Oh my goodness. So I'm told everything here is exclusive to the museum. So if you want some stuff, you're gonna have to come here to get it. So I'm not gonna go through everything because there's so much, but I'm gonna go through, you know, we'll, we'll go through a lot of it because you know me, I'm very thorough with everything. So there's a lot of new stuff for this reopening. And look at these little acrylic stands. Oh, I like that. Oh, you can only <laughs> you can only buy 42 per person. Okay. So they're little they little blind bags. Yeah, little acrylic stands. How much are these? Oh, no, 990. <gasps> that says honey roasted peanuts. Oh, <laughs> take it out of his head. That's really cute. It's almost like a little popcorn bucket, isn't it? That's fun. $29.70 for that. These little cakes? Yeah, little cakes. $23.76. Now look at the little tins. That is so nice. Oh, I'm a sucker for anything that has like the name of it, right? So, Stupid Museum Tokyo. Yes, yes, please. 3,300 yen for that. Yeah, so a lot of stuff has a limit, so this is three per person. Little pouches, a little like patch. Brown's store. How much are you? Oh, 19, 1980. Oh, yeah, we have, oh, little ears. Oh, and it comes with the collar. Oh, that's funny. This is new, 2530. Oh man, there is a lot of stuff. Oh no, those aren't clear files. Okay, no, I remember. They just told me that they don't have the clear files in yet. They will be getting clear files at some point. Not particularly this design, but they'll have some at some point soon. So oh, I want to look at the clear files because you know me, I love a clear file. We got some masking tape. So it's a lot of stationary type of stuff here. Oh, it's so adorable. Oh, that's a nice pillow. Oh, that's nice and soft. Forty-one eighty for that. And we got some book bags. Oh, look at that. That looks nice and soft. Twenty-two. He is so. That is so soft. Looks like a little pencil case. Oh, 3,300 for those. They're little pouches. Oh, these are thick. 3,850 for those. These are, these are nice. And there's that tree again. <laughs> Whole bunch of Snoopy plushes. They're so soft. Oh, the, Wait, can you buy this? Oh, you can buy this. 17,600. Oh, that's cool. Does it work? A lot of plushes, a lot of different variety of plushes. Oh, I like the pink. That is so nice. And he's kind of like a, a gray color here, like kind of a pastel gray and a pastel like pink, pinkish purple. Oh, little keychains, 2200 yen for those. And yeah, they're all Snoopy Museum. Oh, I like Woodstock. 
with the little bag. Oh, they all, they all have bags. Oh, I just noticed that. Oh, that is really cute. And if you need a bag to carry all your stuff that you're buying, what's over here? Oh, keychains. Okay, keychains and buttons. Oh, oh, I like that. 1870. Oh, these, oh, these are letters. Okay, I see. And smartphone cases and luggage tags. Oh, a mat, a welcome mat. 19,800 for that one. And this one's 16,500 yen. Oh, wait, what's this? Books and art. <laughs> Snooping Woodstock, iconic. Oh, this is all like the postcards and stuff. Oh, these are little pop-up cards. Oh, that's really fun. Yeah, there's a lot of new stuff. 660 for those. And some wooden clips. 1430 for them. Oh, these ones are magnets. Oh, these are clips. <laughs> these little posters? Yeah, little posters. Oh, oh, I can buy this? Because I did, I did like this in the traveling room. I thought that was really nice. They're 880. Got some posters, some more posters. Oh, I like that, 1100. So much detail. Oh. <laughs> that was probably one of my favorite rooms, I think. That and the traveling one, I really enjoyed that. Oh, postcards, yep. Of things from within the museum. 242 is how much they are for these ones. And there's some new ones over here, 330. I mean, this is from the travel filling room? Well, this one is for sure. Oh, these are nice. Oh, I like that they're the, like, like banner shaped. Postcard, 385. That's right, Snoopy. Life is too short to not live it up a little. Mm-hmm. Giving, the only real joy is giving. <laughs> it's my life and I'm the only one who has to live it. I mean, that's true. <laughs> love songs. To me, love songs are like eating too much ice cream. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm not sure. How do you interpret that? All is well. That's my new philosophy. <laughs> sure. I want to be all love. No, don't we all, Linus? Oh, we can buy like a, like a newspaper. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> that is really neat. 550, that's how much those are. So looks like there's two different ones. You can see what's inside them here. Oh, we have books. Food and peanuts. Ah, oh, Snoopy Museum Tokyo. Beautiful. So a lot of these are going to be in Japanese, right? Lucy is here. Oh, this is nice. Snoopy Museum Tokyo, 1100. Is this a manga? It is. <laughs> Interesting, okay. That's pretty cool. Oh! <gasps> Oh, is this, this is from the travel, oh, the travel room. Oh, so it has images from the stuff that was in the travel room. Oh, that is really cool. This is 1870 for it. That's really cool. I like that. We're not done yet. There's still a lot of stuff. <laughs> we got mugs and cups. Oh, little chopstick rests. Salt and pepper shakers and plates. Some camping stuff. Lunch boxes. 
lunch cases. Oh, there's the acrylic blind bags. Oh, they have Tomika's. Welcome to the Snoopy Museum. Oh, that's fun. Look at that. <laughs> 12, 10, and 14, 30. Oh. Let me put the little flowers in. 1650. Oh, original capsule toy, 880. Well, that's fun. I do like that. <laughs> Strawberry, yuzu, and blueberry. The little cookies. Ooh, lemon cake. There's so much stuff here. Oh my goodness. <gasps> they have a t-shirt. Oh, that's nice. I probably won't fit the t-shirt, but I do like the idea. I like that it exists. That makes me happy. We have hand towels. And I'll say Snoopy Museum on them. Towels are very popular because everyone carries them because not all restrooms have towels or paper towels or hand dryers. So it's just nice to have one on you. Also, if you're sweating and stuff, it's just nice to, you know, pat yourself. These are cute designs. I kind of like that one. Little tote bags with different comics on them. Barf. <laughs> Hoodies and oh, t-shirts. Oh, XL, that's nice. Okay, the bags are 3,300 yen. Hoodie, 88, okay, and t-shirts look like they range around 3,000 yen. So there's a workshop that you can build your own Snoopy. That requires a separate reservation though, so just make sure you check the website. But you get to get your own Snoopy and then fill them up with fluff. It's kind of like Build-A-Bear, right? And you get to choose the t-shirts. Look at that, it's so cute. Oh, and little collars. Look at the collars. That's really fun if you want to build your own Snoopy. Now it is time for lunch. So we have the cafe here. And you don't have to worry about a reservation. You don't need one. You can just show up. So they have quite the variety of food here. Ooh, I'm excited. Let's go get something to eat. I'm starving. It's a very lovely day out today. A little chilly though. Peanuts Cafe. It's not eating, it's dining. Oh, look on the little Oshibori they wrote on here. Welcome to Peanuts Cafe. Have a nice day. I like the cutlery, that's fun. <laughs> we got all the food here, so we're gonna give it a try. There's a lot. Here we have a Snoopy's Grand Slam crepe, and it's from when he went to Wimbledon. How cute is that? This looks really good, and it smells, you can smell the strawberry. Oh, I love strawberries. Well, I'm just gonna get everything in it. Let's, let's just get it all in. It's chocolate and strawberries and everything. Mm. Very strawberry forward. It's nice and light and airy. Well, this is delicious. I really enjoy the strawberry ice cream on here too. And just like a lot of things, it's not overly sweet, which is right up my alley. I don't need things that are just jam packed full of sugar, you know? Mm. Here is the Backpack in Favorite Milkshake, which is the vanilla milkshake. And I love the chocolate dripping down the cup. That's really nice. And then on top here, it looks like there's whipped cream. And I think that is caramel popcorn and some chocolate Cheerios, it looks like, and mm. a roll cookie. <laughs> a 
There's a lot of flavors going on. The presentation on this is top notch. The vanilla, nice and mild, just like what vanilla is. And I like how it complements with the chocolate. The chocolate is very powerful, but not in a bad way. And it's not super sweet, just like the crepe. I do like the caramel popcorn on here with the Cheerios. This is really tasty. If a milkshake is not your thing, they actually have a hot chocolate version. Comes in this really cute cup. And look at this little wooden spoon with Snoopy. So we got some caramel corn and chocolate Cheerios and the little roll cookies. Mmm. This one's gonna be a little more messy to drink, I think. So this is a hot chocolate and it tastes it tastes like hot chocolate. There's no surprises here, but the presentation is top notch and it's not super sweet, just like everything else, which I really do enjoy. Now, which one do I like more? Do I want, do I like the milkshake or do I like the hot chocolate? Presentation wise, I really love this. I love this whole motif here, but flavor wise, I think I'm gonna have to go with the vanilla milkshake. When you get a drink, you get a coaster. And we got two of them here with nice artwork. These are nice little collectibles. The main meal we're having is Spike's Mexican tacos with minestrone soup. Look at, look at the cup. <laughs> it's a build your own tacos, which I do quite enjoy. So we got some salsa here and avocado, jalapenos, carrots, cabbage, pulled pork, minced meat, lettuce, and then we have our tortillas and we got spike on there. I like that little detail, that's super cute. Yeah, and you have a bunch of tortillas here. So we're gonna dig into this. I'm gonna do the pulled pork first. Avocado. Oh, oh, oh. I do love jalapeno. Some carrots. I always overstep these. That's kind of my thing. I think everyone does that. Oh well. Salsa. Oh, there's no cheese. I just noticed that. No, that's okay. So far, so good. I'm scared I'm gonna get this all over myself. Oh, that is a nice barbecue pulled pork. And I like the, the jalapenos give it a nice kick. I really like that. Avocado, nice and creamy. The salsa is not too spicy, but the jalapeno makes up for that. Next I'm gonna try is the minced meat. Oh, and it looks like there's beans in here too. Mmm. Let's get some avocado going. And a little less lettuce this time. I put too much last time. Mmm. The beef has some spice to it. Ooh, I like that a lot. Nice and flavorful. There's a lot of spices in it. And adding all the other toppings, delicious. I think I prefer the, the minced meat over the, the pulled pork. There's a lot more flavors going on. I, ooh. Mm. I love tacos. Who doesn't love tacos? There's a lot of vegetables in this. There's, look at that. It's very hefty, very hearty. Nice and warm, chunky, and it just warms you to the core because it, it, you know, it's a little, it's a little chilly outside today. For the cafe here, this is the perfect spot for a nice light meal. This is not very heavy food, which is nice because sometimes you don't want a heavy meal. The crepe, yeah, definitely get the crepe. And maybe if your stomach can hold more food, get the milkshake too. I do like the tacos. I do like, I just like the novelty of putting my own tacos together. I think that's really fun. I mean, did you think I was gonna go through the shop and not buy anything? Like, come on. Look at this bag. How adorable is this bag? <laughs> and a little tape, look at the little tape. So yes, I did buy some stuff. 
and full transparency, I pay for all this. This is out of my own pocket. First, got a cute little Snoopy with a little bag. Look at the little bag. Look at that, that's so adorable. He's nice and soft. Yeah. Postcard, I wanted to get this picture because I really loved it inside the travel section. I, brilliant. I know there was like the poster that you could buy, but I have nowhere to really put that on my wall. So I thought, you know what? A postcard is just as good. A pin. And again, it has the name Tokyo. Snoopy Museum Tokyo on it. I have to get that. And as I mentioned earlier, they don't have the clear files available yet, so I couldn't get one. I'll probably have to come back. I got one of the gotcha figurines, so we're gonna open it up together so you can see what I got. So these are original capsule toys. Okay, which one do we get? What do you think I got? Snoopy? Charlie Brown? I don't remember what the other ones were. I got the piano with Snoopy and Schroeder. There we go. That is nice, that is really cute. If you wanna get your tickets for the Snoopy Museum, I recommend buying them ahead of time, right through the website, it's all in English there, and you'll save yourself a little bit of money. So make sure you come and check out the Snoopy Museum and get yourself one of these really adorable tickets. Thank you so much for the Snoopy Museum for inviting us out so we can show you around this wonderful museum. I think I'm going to head back inside because I loved it so much. <laughs> All right, Explorers, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.